Happy Sunday, Royal Kids! It's me, Teacher Rika. Today is the first Sunday of February. Grabe, ang bilis, no? Sa nagdaang Sundays of the month of January, ay marami tayong natutunan about Fruit of the Spirit. And there's more Royal Kids! Alam kong excited kayo para sa next at bagong fruit na ating matututunan this Sunday. Pero bago yon, mas ma-excite muna tayong magpuri at umawit para kay Lord. ating Bible lesson, let's ready our hearts and our listening ears para sa bagong fruit of the spirit na ating matututunan mula kay Teacher Jelly. Good morning, Royal Kids! Last Sunday, we talked about the fifth fruit of the spirit. Ano nga ulit yan? Tama, kindness. So this week, we will learn another fruit of the spirit which is faithfulness. Ano kaya sa tingin ninyo ang meaning ng faithfulness, Rahel Kids? Faithfulness is the result of the Spirit working in us. Siya ang witness natin para sa mga promises ng Lord. That if tatanggapin natin siya or ang katotohanan tungkol sa Kanya ay maliligtas tayo. So remember, Rahel Kids, that faithfulness is trusting and doing what God says in the Bible. Galatians chapter 5 verses 22 to 23 says, But the fruit of the Spirit is love, joy, peace, forbearance, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, and self-control. Against such things, there is no law. The Bible tells us that faithfulness is the fruit of the Spirit. That if we are saved, 
ang Holy Spirit ay nabubuhay sa atin and we can be people who are overflowed with faithfulness. But that does not mean that we will be faithful all the time. Dahil habang nahikilala natin ang Lord, ay nagbabago tayo. Faithfulness becomes part of who we are. And with the Spirit living inside of us, He gives us the power to be faithful. Did you know, Royal Kids, that's one of the main ways that the fruit of faithfulness is shown in our lives as a believer is through our faithfulness to Him. Kaya paano ba natin pinapakita ang pagiging faithful natin kay Lord? Una, worshiping Him. Pangalawa, obeying His word. Pangatlo, knowing His word. And lastly, praying to Him. So now, I want everyone to close your eyes for a moment and think about the word faithfulness. Faithful ka ba sa family mo? Faithful ka ba sa friends mo? Or are you an unfaithful person? So please open your eyes. Remember Royal Kids na even your life is showing you to be an unfaithful person. You have a great hope na matay si Jesus Christ upang makilala natin si Lord. And we begin to display the fruit of the Spirit sa buhay natin para buuin at baguhin tayo into a person of great faithfulness. Faithfulness sa Kanya and faithfulness sa ibang tao. And no matter how unfaithful tayo kay Lord, His faithfulness towards us will never ever change. Always remember, Royal Kids, that He is always faithful. Everything He says, He will do. And everything He promised, He will keep. And that's all for today. Thank you, Royal Kids. See you next Sunday. Bye-bye! Praise God for that lesson. Ano nga ulit ang bagong fruit of the Spirit na ating natutunan, Royal Kids? Tama! Faithfulness. Remember, Royal Kids, as we know God more and more, we are able to become more like Him. We will become faithful because our God is a faithful God. At ngayon naman, mag-ready tayo para sa ating activity time na ituturo ni Teacher Chanda. Your faithful God, faithful God, your faithful God forever. We are here again, Royal Kids! It's Sunday! How are you today, Royal Kids? Nakapag-pray na ba kayo today? Don't forget to pray every time nagigising tayo sa umaga, ha? Ray Kids, naaaralan niyo ba ang siyam? The fruit of the Spirit na inaaral natin? Sige nga, isa-isa-isa nating balikan. Love, joy, peace, patience, and kindness. Nasa ika-anim na tayo, Royal Kids! May idea ba kayo kung ano ang ating pang-anim na fruit of the Spirit? Kinantayo ni Teacher Chanda! Tama! Faithfulness! Ready na ba kayo para sa ating activity, Royal Kids? Kung gano'n, ihanda na natin ang ating mga kailangan. Ang band paper, ang gunting, at kung ano-ano pang ating mga pangkulay. Tara, gawin na natin! Step 1, get the pen paper and draw across kaya nang nasa picture. Step 2, sulat mo sa ibaba or kung saan gustong ilagay ang pwede mong magawa para may pakita mong faithful ka kay Lord. Step 3, kupitin natin at ilagay sa 3. Tapos na natin, Royal Kids! Ang dali lang, di ba? Nice one, Royal Kids! Good job! So, ngayon, may first ako sa inyo ay si-share. Ito ay matatagpuan sa James 2, verse 17. So, you see, faith by itself is enough unless it's for you good deeds. It is dead and useless. Yes, you can pray hundred times, 
But if you don't take deliberate action to change or improve yourself or your situation, your prayer is useless. You're wasting time. But the Lord reward us not according to our achievements, but according to the quality and level of our faithfulness. Okay ba yun, Raya Kids? Okay ha, hanggang dito na lang ako. Bye-bye! I love you all! ating activity for this Sunday. It's all about faithfulness. Nawa ay maalala nyo ang faithfulness ni Lord sa tuwing nakikita nyo ang cross na iyan. Don't forget to take a picture at isend ito sa amin na Okay, it's time for our memory verse. Hi, Royal Kids! Magandang umaga! Ano na nga ang pang-anin na fruit of the Holy Spirit na pinag-uusapan natin? Wow! Ang galing! Lahat nakikinig, ha? Tama! Faithfulness. Meaning, katapatan o pagiging tapat. And in connection with this, our memory verse for today comes from the Proverbs chapter 3, verse 3. That love and faithfulness never leave you. Bind them around your neck, write them on the tablet of your heart. That is the Proverbs chapter 3, verse 3. You know what, kids? God alone is faithful. And as we anchor our faith in Him, the fruit of the Holy Spirit, which is faithfulness, will manifest in us, in you also. So let us recite again our memory verse. Proverbs chapter 3, verse 3. It says, let love and faithfulness never leave you. Bind them around your neck and write them in the tablet of your heart. Proverbs chapter 3, verse 3. Ang galing nyo, Royal Kids! So, patuloy nating pag-aralan ang uh, tungkol kay God sa pamamagitan ng pag-attend ninyo sa ating uh, Royal Kids Sunday School Service. Katulad nito, upload natin yung ating mga video Uh, ating mga video ng memory verse tapos submit natin kids ha so with that bye bye na see you next Sunday God bless grabe yung faithfulness ni Lord sa buhay ng bawat isa at kung iniisip mo royal kids na hindi ka nagiging faithful kay Lord keep spending time with our faithful God at patuloy kanyang babaguhin upang maging faithful Yung faithfulness ni Lord ay hindi kailanman magbabago. Kahit na kung minsan ay nagiging faithless tayo sa Kanya. Mananatili siyang tapat sa lahat ng oras. Lahat ng sasabihin niya ay gagawin niya. Bawat promise niya ay tutupad din at ikikip niya because He is a faithful God. Thank you for spending your time to our faithful God by watching online Sunday School. Hanggang dito na lang Royal Kids. Don't forget to like our Facebook page and subscribe to our YouTube channel. See you next Sunday. Bye-bye!